This is Code.org. I'm currently working on CS Fundamentals. Use what you've learned to build this design where the squares have 80 pixel sides and the artist jumps 80 pixels over and down between them. Ah, we can do that. Let's see, 80 pixel sides, 80 pixels down. Okay, so this is pretty similar to a triangle, well, except a different amount of sides. First and foremost, let's set our length to be, well, 80. And now, how many sides are in a square? Four. And then how many are we drawing? One, two, three, yep, four. So actually, I'll use that. Boom. So I want to make four sides four times, because four squares. So, uh, move forward artist by our length, which is 80. Cool. Then what do I want to do? Well, I'm going to want to turn to the left by how many degrees is each corner of a square, right? Each angle in a square is 90 degrees. So I'll turn 90 degrees to the left, hit the bottom, zoop. now draw the second side, zoop. and now time three through the loop through the third side, and then zoop, fourth side. And I should end up exactly here. What do I want to do then? Well, once I've run it four times, I should put some code here. I will jump forward by 80 by length right because length means what 80 oops this should be outside of it because i want to do this after i draw all four sides i want to jump forward by 80 and then let's see where this gets me let's test it oh Oh, well, I drew four. Okay, I jumped forward by 80. Oh, I need to jump down because I started at this point. So now I'm going to want to turn right by 90, jump again by 80, and then turn left so I'm back facing this direction by 90. And that, I think, should do it. So what I'm it's going to happen is, hey, computer, set length to 80. Now do this four times, because I want to draw four squares. Boop. First off, draw all four sides. Draw one side, turn, zoop. Draw next side, turn, second side, third side, fourth side. Once we're done with that, jump forward length, so I jump to here. Turn right, so I face this way. And then I jump forward the length, which is 80. Then I turn left, so I'm facing this way again. I hit the bottom, zoop, boop, and do it again. And I do it all three times for four squares. Let's, well, I do it all four times for four squares. Let's see. But da uh, Beautiful. Variables are super handy, and like we just did in the last puzzle, all I would have to change is that length variable, and the whole picture would be different. That's awesome. Uh, on to the next lesson.